reduced unemployment. For some, the reduction in our unemployment juxtaposed against seeing in communities young men still not employed in formal and meaningful economic pursuits, in seeing our young men still being involved in criminal activity, in seeing so much human resources literally going to waste. It may seem as if the figures are not adequately capturing those persons. The truth is, we haven't changed the way in which we have been calculating unemployment over the last 30 years when the numbers have been very high. It's the same metric that is used. What has changed is that the fiscal management of the country has created an environment of confidence in the business community, particularly as it relates to the stability in taxes. And in parallel, the development of the institutional framework, particularly as it relates to monetary policy and foreign exchange management, which has given the private sector the confidence to invest. And this investment is pulling in to formal employment those persons who are willing to work, seeking work, have educated and upskilled themselves to be able to take advantage of work. Where we are at now in the society is that we have literally absorbed all those persons into the formal economy. And so what, where we are now as a government, we never had this problem before, but it's a good problem to have. We have to rapidly engage those who are on the margins of our society, who have, by whatever circumstances, have decided that they don't want to participate in the labor force. Either because they may feel that the economics of the current wage level is such that it doesn't provide them an incentive to work, or that criminal activities may pay them better, or it may be that they have decided to stay home and be maintained. Or they may very well feel that because they have no education and no skills, it does make sense that they put themselves in the labor market. So the government has to create new programs through HART NSTA and by extending the school leaving years you would notice that we have added on two additional years to school leaving and we are putting in all kinds of programs to keep our youngsters in schools so that when they leave, the transition from school to work is seamless. All of these programs are being instituted as we speak.